Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome back to a new Ninjago Season 11 discussion video here on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about and kind of questioning the quality of the upcoming Ninjago Season, or at least the one that's airing right now, and whether or not it'll actually end to be one of the better Ninjago Seasons or one of the worst. Now, let me just say right off the bat, it's really hard to judge whether or not the season will actually be good or bad, and in my opinion, you know, to get an actual definitive answer, we should probably wait until the actual end of the series to determine that. So instead, this video is just going to be a sort of prediction based off of the way that things are going now. I can't really put a definitive title as to whether or not the season will be good or bad, but you understand what I'm saying. We can basically predict what it's going to be based on the episodes that we have and if the episodes that are going to come in the future will keep to the same level of quality. So essentially season 11 has been carrying a lot of mixed reactions from fans and viewers. I, I you know, I actually think that the season is pretty good so far. I've only seen a few episodes at this point, but nonetheless it actually is still pretty great. I, I find myself laughing a lot. I find myself really enjoying myself while watching it. But again, some other people just really aren't feeling that. I've seen a lot of people on social media say that the season really isn't that great and that maybe Ninjago should have ended with March of the Oni, which again is a fair opinion. I mean, everybody's entitled to their own opinions, but I don't think it, we can really, you know, justify, you know, putting things off like that. I don't think we can really go ahead and say that this season is definitively bad, just like how we can't say that this season is definitively good. I don't know where this season will rank amongst my other seasons once it finally gets done airing. I think in, I think it's September here in the United States, I think it finally gets done airing. So this is going to be going for a while. So for a few months, what we can do is we can just sit and watch each episode. We can analyze it. We can make our own opinions on that. And if we like them, well, then we like them. More power to us. But if we don't like them, that's okay. Okay, too. Again, there's not really a definitive answer that anyone can basically put on there. You know, we, none of us can really say, hey, this is objectively good or hey, this is objectively bad. Everything in the Ninjago community is based around opinions and a lot of opinions do exist within ranking videos, believe it or not, or any sort of ranking list. We can go ahead and say that something is great and we can also go ahead and say that something really could have been better. What's there to say? But if I had to go ahead and make a prediction as to where this season would actually fall, I would say that this season, when it ends, will actually be pretty favored by a lot of fans. I mean, I'm sure a lot of people will come to like it once it gets done, and once it's concluded, and I'm really excited to see what's to come after that then. Because if this season's really great, well then a lot of other seasons will be pretty good as well. Again, there will probably be a few bad episodes like there are with every season and like there are with every TV show. I, for one, am really excited for that, and I hope a lot of you guys are as well. So let me know down in the comments what you think. Will season 11 actually turn out to be one of the better Ninjago seasons, or will it actually be one of the worst? Tell me why or why not you think that down below in the comments, and I look forward to reading those. But of course, with all that being said, that'll just about do it for this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching this one. If you enjoyed the video, as always, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up rating, and of course, remember to hit the subscribe button if you've not done so already. Once again, guys, the comment section is there for the various discussions that you would like to have regarding this topic, or if you just had a comment of a general nature, that's fine as well. In the description, you will find the links towards my other forms of social media, whether it be my Twitter, my Instagram, my Patreon, or my merch. Again, be sure to support me on all those platforms if you would like to. With all that being said, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video once again. My name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you farewell. Oh.